I don't know whether you know this game, but this is a game called Social Empires. And if you know it, you might be wondering how am I actually able to play this game at this moment in time, considering it is 2020. Well, I will not tell you. You can check on YouTube, it is pretty easy to do. However, I am going to say it now, it's dangerous, I might have ruined my PC forever, just because I really want to play this guy's name game, but I've been obsessed with it for many years, I really wanted to play it, and I'm sad that I couldn't. So now, this is a hacked, some strange ver- This is a strange version of it, which is not on English clearly enough. But yeah, this is the lottery, I got myself a single thing. Also, if you know more about this game than me, please feel free to tell me. However, for you today, I'll be destroying a lot of different creatures. I assume- I think these are goblins. Uh, I'm not all of them clearly enough, but yeah. I have this little army right over here. And uh, yeah, we'll see how all of this is gonna go. We're testing out by clearing out this whole area because I have to, because I'll get more units if I do. Now, I assume the battle is going well. I hopefully haven't lost anyone. This number right over there, I'm actually not certain whether you can even see it. Yeah, oh, everything will be annoying. But yeah, let's just say that there's a number that says how many troops they have at the moment, and I'm kind of afraid it's gonna go down. So while the battle is going on, can I simply... Okay, still one hour. Okay, there's time. I'll eventually have dragons, many different creatures here. At the moment, I have only two very notable creatures that serve me. One is... Medusa, and the other one, actually, is... Oh my goodness, Poseidon. I somehow forgot the name of the Greek god. Yeah, the turrets are gonna be annoying. How am I gonna deal with this? Oh yeah, I'll deal with it in my favorite way, with disposable units that they do not care about. My favorite strategy in this gosh damn game. Also, I don't know why I struggled with saying the word strategy. I use only archers because uh, I feel as if these guys have a better chance of surviving. I've noticed that the mini units, even the very, very powerful ones, Always get completely utterly wrecked. So, the units of the game kind of have a mind of their own and they can attack from time to time by their own volition, so I should really try to avoid that. Also, oh, yeah, okay, because everything is closed, this guy is not going to power. Brilliant. Also, you should probably move away. Oh no, they actually saw me, didn't they? No, they did not. How brilliant. Okay, that's. Oh wow, did I actually get almost everyone out of the fortress? Whoa, this is too easy. This is gonna take some time, but I feel like I kind of want this. Unfortunately enough, I kind of have to get rid of all these battle towers. Because if I don't, then the units I'm about to save will literally just get obliterated as well. Oh, very sad. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot sometimes the enemies actually decide to attack on their own volition. Lower the gate within the Gardam Castle, and I'll close it almost instantaneously. There we go. Now every close the Gardam gate. And my soldiers make sure that these guys do not live. Yeah, brilliant. Ah, that's why archers are much better than melee units. Alright, alright, alright. That's why you actually need gates. And combat is over, I believe. Yeah, there's only these guys left. Ah, this is so annoying though. I don't really want to deal with this. Okay. I will leave that goblin there left because I don't want to release these guys prematurely and even though it actually gives the option to release them I might accidentally release them anyway so yeah let's not unlock everything come on I wasted so much time now these guys will literally despawn before yeah uh, this is not enough I'm so sad I can have only one Poseidon at a time it truly I guess it would be a little too overpowered if my whole army consisted of these guys but still and also I guess my whole screen won't be able to handle it but that's besides the point once again for some reason there is a glitch because this obviously enough isn't the official game because the official game is gone, you can never play it. Uh, you can actually destroy a building and you can still attack it even though it has zero health. And this is destroyed all the zone. Hey, I lost an octopi or two. But this is gone. Anyway, yeah, he also has another summon but uh, it's kind of useful against a lot of melee units. The octopi are definitely much better. And yeah. That damn horse actually did exactly what I thought it was gonna do. Besides the point, uh, let's actually leave this guy right over here, destroying this wall. And what? 
What this has on zero health? This should not be happening. Oh, come on. Oh, it's not on zero health. Oh, I'm blind. I really am. Okay, should be careful not to lose him. Should be careful. And I'm so glad that that goblin is just sitting there for no apparent reason. And I broke a wall. Brilliant. It means that catapults actually have an exit route. And this is on zero health, right? I'm not imagining things. Okay, this. Right, I really shouldn't have made the assumption that the other one also is, but whatever. Oh yeah, okay, cool. Just finish the cash down mission. Just destroy this one tower. I win. I win and the video is uh, pretty much a success. Okay. Right. Well, I almost win. I just kind of have to have someone get rid of this one little thing and then have my Poseidon just come back. But then I am definitely gonna win. Yeah, I guess I might as well have Poseidon take care of things. Yeah. Might as well actually use the Typhoon, I think. Is it? I don't know what this is. Doesn't matter. It's a unit that... Actually, is it actually gonna get there on time? There is might... Yeah, there is a possibility I might have made a slight mistake. Uh, no. No, it appears we're cool. Okay. Can you defeat the weakest enemy in the game? You little summon. It does one damage, it cannot. And now it's further away. Okay, do it manually. No, you don't. That's dumb. Why did you do that? No, no, no. Doctor, why, doctor, why? Doctor, why can handle a single goblin? There we go. Now, there we go. There we go. And now, I assume I'm gonna get the winning screen because there is no more. Yeah, there we go. Thank you. Oh, this took way longer than it should have. Really, really did. And everyone back within my safe little kingdom. Well, also now we are gonna have some new catwoods that are gonna enter the kingdom. No, you're going back in the kingdom. No, don't go through there, of course. Yep, I always forget that the units are very, very stupid. I really, really do. Uh, the worst thing is, if I don't exactly save in the right moment, and also because this is not the official one, it doesn't save it super properly. Uh, many things can go wrong and I can lose my whole army So yeah, there's so many things that can go wrong with this idea of a playthrough that I have in this game Anyway, we're gonna see this took way longer than it really should have way longer and four units that they actually really don't want anyway But hey, you might have at least had a little fun watching me do all of this, right? I hope so at least